lactose intolerant, low What they got to do? So, so why Hold on. I'm still stuck at lactose in intolerant. church. Yes. And the next thing you know, you having sex with him in an abandoned van? Yes, An Alabama woman brought her ex-boyfriend to court to prove to him that he is the father of her three-year-old son. She also demanded he stop denying the baby and take upon his paternal responsibilities. Mr. Black stated that what they had was just a two-week fling, in which she was also cheating on her boyfriend. Claim that after initially accepting your son, Mr. Black turned his back on you and started denying your baby. Is that correct? Yes, Your Honor. Mr. Black, you state you had only a two-week fling with Ms. Myers while she was cheating on... She claimed he took her three years to bring the case to court because her son is now grown and old enough to ask questions about his father, which he is already doing. She admitted telling her son that Mr. Black is his father. Why have you waited three years to bring this case to court? Well, now Logan's old enough to ask questions. So when it's Logan's first day of school, he'll ask where is Tyrell, or he'll ask why isn't he there. Because he thinks Mr. Black by a lot of mm -hmm. That's what you've told If you promise a child you would show up for their birthday, you show up, whether or not you believe you're their father or not. Don't deprive an innocent child of fatherly love. He doesn't show up for his birthday parties. He promised Logan that he would come to his third birthday party, and he did not show up. So Logan was very... In three years, he claimed never to have done anything for the child. How is that even right? He goes to her family house even with the fact that he has doubts about being the father. Why even bother? Because you admittedly, Mr. Black, you say you haven't done anything. No for this child. No ma'am. Three years. Not only that, he's bought like probably three pair of shoes and he's came to my family's house. So you come to her family's house, but you just aren't really buying. They had gone to high school together and later reconnected on Facebook. We met on Facebook. We went to the same high school. Oh, so you went to high school together? Mm -hmm. And then you reconnected on Facebook? Yes, ma'am. And then what happened? Mr. Myers claimed they started dating, but Mr. Black disagreed. And it turned into what? Dating? It a relationship? It turned into dating. We were talking for like Ooh, almost... We were talking for almost like three months. She thought she had a boyfriend, but he was just using her to pass the time. Because how do you ask someone to have your child and still consider what you have with them casual sex? That's just ridiculous. He was your boyfriend. He was. Casual sex. That's all it was. It was not. That's a lie. You think you in a relationship and got a boyfriend? He asked me to have his child. That's the thing. Two weeks or four months? Whether or not they're right or wrong, making a baby takes just two seconds. Almost four months. Like, he came around my Weeks. family. Like, when I would go places with Logan, Tyrell would show up and my family members would be no. there. I doubt Mr. Black knew that. And what's with him showing up at places where family members are at? But Mr. Black, even though you may say it was just two weeks, you know it it, 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 it really just takes two seconds to make a baby. It, I, I learned that. I he claimed to have gotten a courtesy call at work when she was eight months pregnant, stating she was pregnant and also informed him that the child wasn't his, but her boyfriend's. And that was how he found out she was prepared. And I got a courtesy call at work. A courtesy call? Yes, that's that's not true. Call. That's it not went, true. It went exactly like this. That's I'm not true. I'm just calling you to let you know I'm pregnant. But don't that's worry, not you're not father. It's my boyfriend's baby. Miss Myers claims all he said was a lie. She claimed to have sent him a text informing him she was sick. Here's something in the street. That's not true. I texted him. I texted him and told him that I was sick. And he told me, well, maybe you should go to the doctor. He told her to go to the hospital, which she did. She found out she was pregnant. So I ended up going to the doctor and finding out that I was actually pregnant. So I texted him and I was like, I'm actually pregnant. She called to inform him, but never gave any response. He drifted away slowly and disappeared. And at first, you know, he would, you know, ask how did my doctor's appointment go or how was I feeling? And then he like slowly just like drifted, drifted away. Wait, what? He's just out there dropping babies with different women? Is he just trying to find ways to protect himself? Black just testified clearly. He did not even know you were pregnant until you were eight months pregnant when you called courtesy That's call. a lie. Why would he want to hide the fact that he has other children with different women? But it is, he doesn't want someone to know that he has three different kids by three different women. That, that, that doesn't bother me. If that was the case, he even, we, there's so much that's not true. I can barely tell who's telling the truth. I'm like, okay, so if you're saying I'm not and it's your boyfriend, then why I'm getting this call? That's but not true. I should be alarmed like I'm a little That's confused on can these two just agree on one thing did she or did she not tell him he wasn't the child's father because it was a courtesy call. exactly like That's if, not true. if I'm not the father why are you calling me That's is it because true. you're unsure are you making these other calls I don't know Miss Myers claimed she wasn't dating someone else at the time she was dating Mr. Black 
She also claimed she had informed him three months after she was pregnant and not eight months. Were you dating somebody else at the time you were dating Mr. Black? No, ma'am, and I told him three months after I was pregnant. But Mr. Black still disagrees. We'll find out who the liar is soon. It was not eight months later. It was eight months. That's a lie. Okay, so Jerome, somebody lying. <laughs> what exactly did he find out when the baby was born? Another courtesy call? Find out Logan was born. Same day she had a yarn, I was actually at work on my lunch break. Now it's obvious this man is lying. A lot of things aren't adding up. Another I'm courtesy call? Yep. I'm, I'm, I'm at the hospital. I'm in labor. I'm about to have him. Why is he getting all these calls if he is not the dad? That's and why do you think you're getting that call if you're not the dad? Right. Because at the same time, I got to prove to get off of work. He claimed he was not allowed to enter the hospital when he went there during the time she gave birth to the child. Go to the hospital to see him. When I got there, they told me I was not allowed to see her because she refused to have me That's come in the room. Because her That's boyfriend at the time was there. Oh, wow. He turned back and went straight back to work. Just like that. The way downstairs at the hospital, what did you do? I went back to work. <laughs> went back to work, okay? I had to get my money. He didn't think to put a call through or something? Doesn't look like he really wanted to know if he was the dad. You don't know why she's calling me, because the guy up there must be the dad. He even signed a birth certificate there, so that let me know he had to be the father. That's not true. It Wait, what? Someone else signed the birth certificate? You can't just decide who signs your baby's birth certificate based on their behavior or availability. That's entirely wrong, and somebody needs to let her know. Yeah, so that let me know he had to be the father. That's not true. It's, it he was a reason the for all of that. It, at the hospital, it was right a reason there. for all of that. There better be a reason, because all of this doesn't even make an iota of sense. Carl Tyrell, and I said, hey, I'm in labor. And apparently his his girlfriend at the time, or whoever she was, she snatched, he was not at work. She snatched the phone from him. Do we call Mr. Black irresponsible? for someone that said he was eager to know if he was the father or not. Three days later, and I did tell the nurse, you know, don't let him up because I've had this baby by myself. I've and he had to wait three days before showing up to the hospital? So much for being eager. I through this by myself and I called him and he didn't come because she told yeah. him oh, not Hold to. on, so you're saying he didn't show up the day the baby was he born? He showed up three The question we have all been waiting for, why did they let another man sign the birth certificate? Why did you let another man sign the birth certificate? Because I was young and it was wrong. I was young and I was angry and I was talking no. to him. No amount of emotions running through a woman should ever let another man that's not the biological father sign the certificate. Were you dating or no. could he potentially be the father we could, too? We were just dating. She affirmed that she's 100% sure he is the father. He could not potentially Thank be the God. father. I'm 100% that he's his dad. Like I slept with nobody. Lactose and Tolerant? What has that got to do with when did that become hereditary? He looks just like him. He's lactose intolerant. Logan what that got to do? What that got to do? I'm quite confused. Or am I just getting this whole thing wrong? Something that's hereditary. So, so why Hold on. I'm still stuck at lactose intolerance. <laughs> I don't think that's sufficient evidence, Ms. Is she convinced he is the father because he is lactose intolerant? Or because he was the only one she was sleeping with at the time? Ms. Myers, are you convinced Mr. Black is the father because he's lactose intolerant? She better not say lactose intolerant. Mr. Black has so much doubt that he hasn't even agreed to anything she had said. Or because it's the only man you were really sleeping with at because the time. Because it was the only man I was sleeping no. with at the time. For him to disagree with her on this, he better have a valid explanation or evidence. So you weren't having sex with anybody else? No, ma'am. How do you three, know she was with somebody else? Three months after Logan was... How exactly did he know she was with someone else? Before she asked me for a DNA test after she asked two or three other... That's a no, so it was process a elimination. She claimed she never asked him for a DNA test but stated that she told him if she had to pay for a DNA test. I'm going asked down. me for a DNA test. And I told him, sure, since you want to act like Logan's not yours, if I have to pay for a DNA test, I'm going to put you on child support. She would place him on child support, but he disappeared again after he heard this. When I mentioned child support, he disappeared again and no, did not ask I anything else about test. a DNA test. So you've never asked anybody I else to never, take a paternity test? Never. He seemed to be so sure about this. How does he know this has to be true? Why exactly is he just bringing this into conversation? He actually called me on the phone. That's a lie. And had a conversation with me and That's said, a lie. man, I'm actually happy I just dodged the bullet. He's not mine. That's a lie. I hope it works out for you. He <laughs> actually <laughs> told me that. No, he told me that. Oh, come on. Not another courtesy call. I thought we were done with the courtesy calls. But why would her boyfriend call him to tell him that? Wait a minute. You 
got ass. another courtesy call. From her <laughs> ex-boyfriend. One of the ex-boyfriends. No one took a test. Okay. Well, I mean, look, 